Good morning. So it's about 8.30 on a Saturday morning and I'm here. At the Planet Fitness parking lot. Um, I'm going to go in today. I have had bronchitis for like the last two weeks. About two weeks. And um, just now I finally started to get enough energy to go to the gym. But aside from that, there have been so much going on in my life. A lot of life changes. Having my grandson move in with me. My daughter. Um... I have not been inside this gym in about a year. My daughter and uh, my grandson moved in with me about nine months ago. And I know for a fact that I haven't been here since they moved in. And I think honestly, since COVID, I've maybe only been about two or three times. Um, so that's since 2020. So I'm pretty nervous. I haven't been inside the gym in forever. Um, yeah, I'm just really nervous, but I'm going to go give this a shot. Okay, so I did it. I'm back out. It is 9.57, so I was in there about an hour and a half. I did tan, so that was like 12 minutes. So I figure about 15 minutes for, you know, getting in and out of the tanning bed. But, um, so yeah, that was like at least an hour I did a lot of the machines, like a lot of the weight machines, uh, like the biceps, triceps, you know, chest press, uh, row, all those things. And then I did some time on the um, elliptical. So I feel pretty good about it. I was pretty intimidated going in and I feel really awkward and self-conscious in the gym, but I've always done that. and but it wasn't bad there wasn't a lot of people in there and honestly for the most part um i think two people like smiled and kind of said hey you know just kind of acknowledge me for the most part nobody else in there really uh, paid me any attention at all so i don't know why i'm so intimidated in the gym but i think gym intimidation is just something that's really I think it's something that a lot of people deal with. So I think it's just pretty common and just a natural thing. Um, especially when you're, you know, you're overweight, you don't look like a fitness model and you haven't really been in the gym in a long time. And you, you feel like you look like you don't know what you're doing, which is pretty much the case with me. But so I think that gym intimidation is pretty common, but I do have it really bad. And, um, but I feel really good. I got a good workout in and the neighborhood that I moved into at the beginning of this year, uh, we have a pool and it's finally open. Yay. So when it first opened, I had some problems with my pool pass, um, unlocking the door to let me in. So I finally got that fixed. And so I think I'm going to go home and go to the pool and get a little, get a little extra water time in today. So so first day back at the gym in about a year, and I got to say, it feels pretty good. So hopefully, hopefully I can uh, keep this going and continue coming here at least a minimum of three, ideally at least four days a week for now. So we'll see how the rest of the week goes. I Today is Saturday. I work tomorrow at the hospital, but I don't go in until... 3 p.m. So I may try to come back out here in the morning when they open at 7. I'll play that by ear, but I'm off work Monday. I do have the day off Monday, so I will definitely be back in here Monday. So we'll just keep seeing how this progress continues and hope that I can get some good momentum and ride the momentum all the way through. So